That heavy wet snow causing concerns over possible roof damage at a volunteer fire company in Niagara County. Worries today about the roof of the Rapids Fire Company on Plank Road in Lockport. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Sierra Johnson with more. And after holding thousands of pounds of snow and ice, the roof at this Lockport fire station is buckling under the pressure of one of the snowiest winters on record in western New York. It's just basically water leaking in because uh, of the drains and so on being plugged up. And that's the only thing we can do right now is just catch it in the buckets and so on. The fire chief of Rapids Volunteer Fire Department says he knew instantly the leaks coming from the station's relatively new roof were weather related. So his company began shoveling the roof around midnight. By morning, they realized they hadn't made much progress. So he called in a few guys to help shovel, and those few guys turned into entire departments. All they did was call fire control and uh, ask for the assistance, and they started showing up. With snow blowers, shovels, and rock salt, more than 50 guys and gals gathered on the roof to help a fellow department in need. The support that came out to assist us is just phenomenal. Many said it's simply the right thing to do. In a job with no pay, odd hours, and dangerous situations, these volunteer firefighters from around the area agreed this is just part of the job. We stick together. We help each other out when we have to. We do whatever we're called for. However we get it done, we get it done. The company's chief said he's confident the snow was removed before it was able to cause significant damage. In all, nearly 60 volunteer firefighters helped the department sew a happy ending out in Lockport. Reporting live, Sierra Johnson 7, Eyewitness News.